everyone and welcome back. Welcome to Storm Akima. Storm here. Mom here. Kimmy here. I object, or do you? <laughs> so they have not seen Legally Blonde. That's no, we right. haven't. We got a lot of requests for this movie. I saw this back in college a while ago. Okay. Um, and I can't wait to watch it again with awesome. you guys. Um, so shall we get into it? Yes, yes let's, let's do it. Do it. <laughs> you guys have to help me pick out the perfect outfit. There's nothing I love more than a dumb blonde with daddy's plastic. You know, it's a kind of you see this one? We just got it in yesterday. Oh. Is this low viscosity rayon? Uh, yes, of course. With a half loop top stitching on the hem? Absolutely. It's one of a kind. It would snag the fabric. And you didn't just get it in. I saw it in the June book a year ago. So if you're trying to sell it to me for full price, you picked the wrong girl. Good oh. girl. Oh. Yeah, good for her. <laughs> uh huh. Sticky, sticky nose up. This is it. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> One of the reasons I wanted to come here tonight was to discuss our future. And I am fully amenable to that discussion. Good. Well, you know how we've been having all kinds of fun lately. Yeah. Well, Harvard is going to be different. Law school is a, a completely different world, uh, and I need to be serious. Of course. I mean, my family expects a lot from me. Right. I expect a lot from me. Mm. I plan on running for office someday. And I fully support that warning. You know that, right? Absolutely. Okay. But the thing is, if I'm going to be a senator by the time I'm 30, I need to stop digging around. <sighs> Warner, I completely agree. Oh, <laughs> Bear with the breakup. Oh. Well, I've been thinking about it, and I think it's the right thing to do. You're breaking up with me? Oh, my my boobs are too big? Oh, oh. Oh, what, what? So when you said that you would always love me, you were just digging around? No, I, I oh, do you. I, <laughs> He's a jerk. <laughs> no, you can't say any of that. <laughs> we have to sell it. <laughs> Someone actually believed him. <laughs> you don't need him. Just get the car. Wow. Nothing else is said. That's it. Oh, they're all going to be staying there waiting yeah. home. Didn't show it then. I always wanted to do that. Just taste a little bit. Of <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. 
as president of my sorority, I'm skilled at commanding the attention of a room and discussing very important issues. It has come to my attention that the maintenance staff is switching our toilet paper from Charmin to generic. All those opposed to chafing, please say I. <laughs> <laughs> I feel comfortable using legal jargon in everyday life. I object. <laughs> I love that one. Yeah. I love how positive they all are. Oh, yeah, they are. They are. And that's why you should vote for me. Elle Woods, future oh, lawyer. Look at that. Her mouth's rope. Yeah. Uh, she's a friend to the animals as well as a philanthropist. <laughs> <laughs> Stuff. <laughs> oh my word. Oh, wow. <laughs> Everyone's so judgy. Guys, yeah. this way. Come on, this is the part where we go around in a circle and everyone says a little bit about themselves. <laughs> Guy over there. Yeah. Uh, my name is David Kidney. Kidney. I have a master's in Russian literature, a PhD in biochemistry, and for the last 18 months, orphans in Somalia. <laughs> Hi, I'm Elle Woods, and this is Freezer Woods, and we're both Gemini vegetarians. I have a bachelor's degree in fashion merchandising from CULA, <laughs> and I was a Zeta Lambda Nu sweetheart, president of my sorority Delta Nu, and last year I was homecoming queen. Oh, two weeks ago I saw Cameron Diaz at Fred Siegel, and I talked her out of buying this truly heinous Angora sweater. Whoever said orange was the new pink was seriously disturbed. <laughs> <laughs> Wish me luck, Bruiser. This is my first class as a serious like his little tie. He is so cute. It's lucky to have a dog there. Right? <laughs> <sighs> you totally look the part. <laughs> Ouch. Oh! 
<laughs> oh, she bobbed her head like oh. she did. <laughs> Luke. <laughs> so you have Stromwell, huh? Yes. Did she do that to you too? No. But she did make me cry once. I mean, not in class. I waited till I got back to my room. But yeah, she'll kick you right in the ball. Yeah, or wherever, you know. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, she's tough. Really tough. Make sure you read the footnotes, because that's where he gets a lot of his exam questions from. Right. He's so good. Yeah. Good. Oh, oh yeah, it's her. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's the same girl. <laughs> have, uh, have you met uh, Dan? Dan? Oh, hi. Vivian Kensington. Do you know her? She's, uh... I'm his fiance. Fiance. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> You're famous at our club. You didn't tell me you'd be here. Pooh Bear, I didn't know she would be here. Pooh Bear, you're using Bear. that same, same name. name. <laughs> Our group is full. Oh, oh, is this like an RSVP thing? No, it's like a smart people thing. Oh. Oh. Come on, guys, we can make room for one more. Oh. We already assigned the outlines. It's dead like. It's terrible. You know, if you had come to a rush party, I would have at least been nice to you. Oh, is that before you voted against me and then called me a dyke behind my back? I don't use that word. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty yeah. terrible. I forgot to tell you. What? What? I got bangs. My hair's so nailed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Keep June first open, one of my bridesmaids, and give Warner our love because I'm getting married. Oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this is she's gonna be a laughing oh, star. God. Like she's the entertainment. That's not. Oh my god. Oh god, that's so embarrassing. Oh, I like your outfit too, except when I dress up as a frigid bitch, I try not to look so constipated. <laughs> 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 oh, <God>. <laughs> <laughs> she laughed. She's been right. <laughs> <laughs> I like how she kept the ears on too. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> She's also for staying at the party for a bit, though. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, she's oh, hanging so out with her. Oh, yeah, that's great. Yeah. What the hell do you want? Mm-hmm. We're lunch. Just thought. Come on. We just thought. Oh, okay. Come here, show me what you're definitely not missing. <laughs> that's not why I came by. Hey, how many times are you going to come over here begging me to take you back? She's a complete jerk. Mm-hmm. And I'm here to discuss the legal situation at hand. Come again? Mm-hmm. I'm taking the dog. Dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, <okay. laughs> so the big baby. Yeah. Look at those few years. Yeah, now she can have a party for me. Yeah. Oh, they're going to be best friends yeah. too. And for that matter, all masturbatory emissions where his sperm was clearly not seeking an egg could be termed reckless abandonment. I believe you've just won your case. Dog with her off everywhere she goes. It's pink. 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 It's
Ya rumah itu. Can I have a class? Bend and snap class. Everyone's so excited. Oh, this is the best thing she could do for him. <laughs> That's right. I'm sorry. Sorry for what? For breaking my heart or for giving me the greatest pleasure I've ever known? And I'm just oh. taking it away. <laughs> She's oh like, God. yes. Yeah. Hey. Find in her so she can get it. I don't trust her. His father had to make a call. You're kidding. <laughs> no way. <laughs> <sighs> oh, God, there's such a precious dog. Hi. His name is Brewster. Do you want to hold him? Oh, he's very friendly. Look, he likes you. Oh, he's giving me kisses. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Jeff. Oh, that's nice. I thought she was just going to give the in try to get the info. <laughs> Here we go. She's oh, gonna do this. Oh, oh, oh. 
I got a big one for you. She's storming yeah. away.
Hey, Your Honor. Well then, Ms. Mm. Woods, proceed. Look how cute! There's like a judge in everything! Ladies, take a Vote for L! <laughs> You were sharing. Um, <laughs> a perm. A perm. Have you gotten the shower? I believe the witness right. has made it clear that she was in the shower. <laughs> yeah, but with a perm, yeah. you're supposed to leave it be, right? Husband. Yeah. She's yes, like, yeah, right. now I gotcha. This now she's confident. Have you ever gotten a perm before? Yes. How many would you say? Two a year since I was 12. <laughs> she didn't and laugh. if in fact you weren't washing your hair, as I suspect you weren't because your curls are still intact, wouldn't you have heard the gunshot? And if in fact you had heard the gunshot, Brooke Wyndham wouldn't have had time to hide the gun before you got downstairs, which would mean that you would have had to have found Mrs. Wyndham with a gun in her hand to make your story plausible. Isn't that right? She's my age. Did she tell you that? How would you feel if your father married someone who was your age? You, however, she had time to hide the gun, father? didn't you, Chet? Oh, she was gonna murder her stepmother? Oh, wow. Oh! Wow. Oh, she just, no. she just freaking confessed. Oh, my God. Wow. Genius. <laughs> That was <laughs> impressive! <laughs> 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 oh my oh, god! He's not holding me! You are the girl for me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. it's only me. You know what? You know what? Pooh Bear. Pooh Bear. Oh, oh. Yeah, all right. Oh. New chapter. You must always have faith in yourself. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Congratulations, class of 2004. We did it! Yay. <laughs> <laughs> We're pretending to stay. Oh, oh, that's oh, so normal. Oh, he's uh, uh, yeah, God. Yeah, I mean, Dub Warner. Yeah. She's oh, not oh, best friend. Yeah, yes. Good for her. Without honors, without, without, without a girlfriend, any, without uh, any no. job offers. Worst mm -hmm. outcome. Yeah. That's right. Oh, your PS guy. Oh, 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 The perfect That's ending. ending. <laughs> oh, oh man, God. I smiled a lot during this. That was great. Yeah, I wish your really girlfriends were there. They probably were in the background. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so it's been years <laughs> since I've seen this movie, and honestly, I really That's enjoyed right. it again. I it's know, it's, it's been yes. it was a lot of fun. That's you know, right. it's it's a, a story about someone who has such positive energy oh, at any you know even with her boyfriend who she thought was going to propose to her breaks up with her she not you know she did you know 
feel bad for about a week yeah. and then she's like she you know got herself put together and she said I'm going to law school that's right mm -hmm. I want to prove myself I want to be you know good good enough for him yeah you know but she did it with such positivity mm hmm yeah. I like seeing mm -hmm. that too because this movie all around is very stereotyped yes. and right. for a reason to a certain extent because in this movie mainly we're judging blondes and that they're airheads and not very intelligent and stuff um, and here Elle really proved everyone wrong and then you have these Harvard students who are very mean and judgmental yeah, and you know, they're saying words like ugly yeah. and too mm -hmm. serious and um, but here we were focused more on Elle being a blonde and that That's she was right. too ditzy to be able to be a lawyer to That's be successful right. doing that um, so to follow her journey through this was a lot of fun and the outcome of most of the characters it was pretty predictable yeah. um there were certain things that i did like that the first time i watched this i did not expect like vivian actually befriending l i really love that part yeah, did that you? was Definitely, wonderful yes. she was so mean yeah, she was nice. yeah she was yeah like when she was saying the right answer and she's just showing her sparkly diamond ring oh, yeah, at her oh, and oh that was really yeah nice. like everything was just really yeah, in her not, face yeah. like very um, easy to follow and you know the characters are exactly what you think they'd be except Vivian did turn around which I was happy to yeah. see that and uh, her ex-boyfriend Warner was just such a jerk yeah, and he here was he was very just very so shallow nice. oh my grandma my family doesn't support um, you like I have to be very serious and I, I have so much pressure on me to do things a certain way and you know uh, he has a lot of history with his family whether they have senators or something so yes. he has to be like top notch and you know what you do like, feel bad for him in that sense you know that he has all this pressure on him yeah. but mm -hmm. the way he called his new girlfriend Pooh Bear oh, and then he went back and very said shallow. that to her. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Very yeah. shallow. Yes. Yeah, and he, it, like the way he talks to Elle, like he wasn't, he didn't really genuinely feel bad about her like being upset and just like oh honey baby come here yeah, you don't want to yeah, ruin your so, shoes yeah, yeah. and just being degrading and stuff mm -hmm. you know like treating her like she's a child mm -hmm. and you know that is Elle's lifestyle like she I love all her friends and how positive they are and everything's like brightly colored mainly right. in pink and, and you know what I think even her sorority they were all so positive oh, I think because happy. of her mm -hmm. they yeah, she just she's resonated just that yeah, yeah. you know and yes. she really looked for the best in people even Brooke when she was accused of murdering her husband I mean she yeah, knew her right. you know in the professional sense of you know best watching her videos. all around yeah. yeah and um you know just she'd always looked for the best right. in people and shame on Professor Callahan too you know that I was sad really, when that, that happened really Dr. Garber yeah I mean yeah. that really sucked because that, that was, was one thing I did forget till right before they had, like, right when she walked into that room, I was like, oh, I totally forgot he was a scumbag. And again, stereotyping, like, here, you know, Elle has challenges every step that's of the right. way. And everything God, bad that's going to happen will happen to you. And here you have your professor who I thought and forgot that, again, he was like that. But I thought he really admired how intelligent she was, yeah, which he did. But happened. he yeah. also was attracted to her. So he took advantage of her. Yeah, right. um, yeah. So I'm like, oh, what a scumbag. That I really know, sucks. because when she um, took over the case from him after Brooke fired him, I thought he was going to just, you know, okay, I do have a respect for you. And, yes, I'd like to have you be my summer intern. But, no, it was all his own, you know, oh, personal, yeah. you know, feelings, what he wanted. Yeah. Not, yeah. For, not for the firm, mm -hmm. really. That's for sure. And it was good to see Elle, you know, she just dismissed him and yeah, walked away and, qu and was going to quit. Like, And then her teacher to actually, the tough teacher to be like, yeah, no, yeah, like if you like, do that, you're not who I thought you were. Right. Like that, that was, was cool. Right. That, that was, that was cool. she had her respect. Yeah, that was, timing was perfect on that. Definitely. Because she was a scary teacher. So it's like, oh God. She was, you know, and, she was, and she was very strict for a reason. I mean, if you're going to be, you know, in court, in trial, I mean, you're going to have those tough to. questions, those tough you know, you know, you just have to yeah, be yeah. that way. And I think right off the bat, she needed, she needed to do that to Elle. But, um, you know, I just loved it at the oh, end when her. she yeah. was for her and had her, you know, be the speaker at the mm -hmm. end. Yeah. Because she's yeah. so positive. 
Yeah, and I like seeing that too where, you know, I see certain movies where you have people who, and I know it's stereotyping still, but like you have people who are like rich and kind of ditzy and whatever. And, you know, I kind of thought first watching this that there were going to be certain people in this that were going to be very bratty and selfish. But all of her friends, no matter how blonde they were, I'll quotate it like that, mm -hmm. but no matter how blonde they were, they were very loyal and caring people. Oh, yes, they, all the way they, through, they yeah, weren't exactly. trying to be mean. They no. weren't trying to, like, they were like the pure hearted, yeah, nice group of people and then everyone else was just like mean and judgy but then people started coming around once they got to know yeah. Ellen stuff that's so right. I do like that happy energy I know it's not very realistic but I I'm yeah, a happy good. person yeah, and you know yeah. um, and, and you know even with Brooke I mean she was you know she was blonde she was this ex exercise guru she made mm -hmm. her she okay. made her own yeah. money um, you know, but she was so much younger than her husband. She she was ter stereotyped That's where right. the daughter found her. So it's got to be true. You That's know, right. yeah. she has no alibi. And, you know, the alibi, I mean, I do yeah. feel bad for her because professionally she doesn't want anyone knowing she had liposuction. But, mm -hmm. you know, that would ruin her. But she she's willing to go to jail for, you know, for murdering murder. her husband yeah. over yeah. her career. Oh my God. I know, that's, so there are certain that. things that, that really so didn't make sense. I mean, I get like she's so sad. passionate that about that. She's so, like, you know, she's personal. such a businesswoman that, that she would, she was willing to do that. But yeah. But should be in jail. Yeah, yeah, and there were certain yeah, things so that you, you could definitely, because yeah. I thought that too, and it's like you could definitely pick it apart, but mm -hmm. there were certain things like I, I was just kind of like, okay, I don't overthink it, but yeah, I mean, like for her to be like that passionate, Brooke, to be like, I'll go to jail. I, I, I really, her, I her, really, her, I her really just think it was her yeah. reputation she Before didn't want to work. Yeah. yeah, she so wanted... Like, it's still your reputation, you're a murderer. <laughs> yeah, and she she didn't want to ruin her reputation as a good businesswoman. Yeah. But she was going to be going to jail. I know. As a murderer. That's the end of your business, it doesn't make sense. Wow. Yeah. No, I, I loved how they of... caught the, the pool boy. That oh, was great. That was, that was funny. funny. And funny. again, like, I know it's very different now. Yes. This movie came out, it said here, on two thousand in 2001. Mm -hmm. And um, immediately, because he knew more about shoes, that he was gay. But at that time, like, you know, I was like, oh, yeah, like, maybe, maybe that's the case. Because, you know, in college, um, I, you know, I had a lot of gay friends. They were awesome. Mm -hmm. And they knew so much more about fashion and <laughs> everything than I did. Yes. Yes. A whole yes. lot more. So yeah. here, like, when yeah. I was like, oh, my God, that guy's gay because he knew my shoes, like, right off right. the Right. She's like, Warner, what kind of shoes do I have on? Black. Black. Yeah. Black. And I thought it was hilarious how, like, was she was quickly questioning him. Or, no, sorry, um, uh, her friend was. And yeah, he's same. like, and what's your boyfriend's name? And he's and like. Oh yeah, oh, and then right, right and he's completely that, yeah. turned it around. And like, he oh, gets he's up, just, he's right there just to prove it more. Oh, he's just a friend. Oh, <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> up. So things were like, like resolving, or like you know, like things were happening really fast in this movie. Yeah, it was a shorter yeah. movie, but again, it was more yeah. about like L and um, not fully about the trial so that could be right gone for a while. so they had all the evidence right so there positive. boom 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 that she was very so positive, positive but very positive. thankfully positive. she had something that she was proficient in oh, like definitely. the perm you know because she was very hesitant and Emmett was trying to push her you got this you can do this yeah that's right, and then yeah. when it clicked with her you know that's good you you wet your hair and everyone was like scoffing like oh, God, how many times do we have to go over this how great is it that <laughs> like these key moments would go back to Elle's, you know, knowledge of fashion, yeah. of hair, yeah. of, like, yeah. of all the things that she, like, loved for so long, mm -hmm. and um, her expertise in it, mm -hmm. and she just really yeah, knew all strange. about that. Um, I've had a perm before. It's been a long time, but, yes, yeah, it does I you have leave it in your hair. Me mm -hmm. too, a long um, time ago. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I enjoyed it at the time, but I don't think I'd ever do that again. I do love that hairstyle on a lot of people, but not And, for you me. know, um... I just love, I also loved the relationship she had with Brooke mm -hmm. and how she brought the gift basket and how she showed, you know, the Cosmo was oh, the Bible. Oh, and oh, yeah, they just totally and, relate yeah, to that yeah. completely. Yeah, that and was And even really with good. Paulette, I mean, everywhere she went, no matter 
um, whatever demographics, wherever she was, she made a friend. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. You definitely. know, and Paulette was her best friend. Yeah. I love Paulette. And honestly, Jennifer Coolidge, I think she's so fun. <laughs> um, she cracks me up. Uh, Stifler's mom. I don't know if you know that, but um, she was in another movie that she's been in a lot of stuff, but that movie like stands out to me, too. And I was like, hee hee hee. But um, I really love her in this. And I forgot how quiet and how much low self esteem she had in this movie, but it was great that she had Elle in her life and she is a good person and Elle was a bright star to help her gain she confidence. She really did, yes. you know, and even with confidence, she helped David get some uh, get some girls on campus. Oh, that's right. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> he tried so hard. I like how she befriended that all these so people yeah, that from, cool. yeah. Yes. Uh, from Harvard, like that was awesome. Yeah, I really like David, and here it says Dorky David. That's what they labeled Dorky him, for guys. Awesome. <laughs> but he was great, and I'm glad that um, yeah. he quickly, like, he didn't have any judgment with no. Elle at all. Like, no, when she not at all. To get a book, he, he was almost her. like they were going to be fine. like partners. <laughs> yeah, and then Luke Wilson, he was awesome. I really liked mm -hmm. him as Emmett. And Vivian was good too. And Vivian know, was good. We know her recently it. from Hellboy. We re recently that's saw right. Hellboy: The Director's that's Cut on her channel, and. If you're watching on YouTube, we have a ton more movies so and shows, oh but mainly gosh, movies yes. available there that haven't hit our YouTube channel yet. Some movies that we talk about you might not be able to find on YouTube yet, but uh, they are all on our Patreon. So we have hundreds, if not thousands oh of videos there yeah. for you to check nice. out. Um, but yeah, so we recently saw Hellboy and Selma Blair was on that okay, and uh, we good. really liked her in that role. Yes. Uh -huh. um, yeah, and I just really like Vivian turning around and being a good person in this one. That was awesome. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And Paulette, I loved. Uh, who else? Um, you know, uh, even the, um, the tougher like intern too, she was pretty good. She was the, with the curly hair and the glasses. I forget her name, but she was. Oh, you know what? She yes. was so oh funny. God, right. um, yeah. I really thought she had a stronger role in this, and um, right. I really thought yeah. she did. And no, I, I thought she, she was. Had more. You know, she was cool at the end. You know, she was accepting of her. You know. Yeah, because yeah. because she was really stepping up on her own. You know, and she was she was. Elle was really getting to the point where, okay, I have to really be serious. I have to prove myself to yeah. these people yeah. every day. So um, I think she just won everybody over and she she blew Warner out of the you know water. Yeah, I mean, she was yeah. just that good. Mm -hmm. And for him to be just like, you know, nothing at the end, I mean, it just goes to show you that you just have to work and she worked okay. so much harder she had everything against her mm -hmm. and she she still succeeded that's right my gosh yeah. but he did have a lot of pressure on him i mean you know when you have all that family pressure and um you know image is everything to him yeah that's what it is yeah maybe you know not. yeah Elle went through yeah. so much and i'm so happy at the end i mean from the start we we knew she was really smart like she knew so much about clothes and then you have these brunettes that were in that store that were like oh watch this i like stupid blondes with a credit card or whatever daddy's credit card <sighs> yes. and immediately Elle called them out and said no i know this is from last year or whatever you're trying to sell me something oh, yeah, that's old that and yeah. give me full price for it no way so immediately and then she mentioned the 4.0 um, and so we know that she's really smart, yeah. you know, with her GPA. Mm -hmm. So, um, you know, so she has the intelligence, but she just never challenged herself elsewhere. Like right. she only right. did what she knew and her parents, and her parents were, were accepting to. of it. You know, don't do that. Yeah. They know? didn't want her to no, do that stuff. don't do that, sweetie. You know, so yeah. to go through all of that and change okay, herself yeah. to show that she can be like everyone else, like a lawyer yeah. and then actually coming into her own and wearing the pink stell and she could still yeah, be exactly. herself yeah, and combine both it. things yeah. with her little puppy by her side puppy all the time the so yeah. Yeah. yeah 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 so i love i love how she could bring the dog everywhere and it was okay he was oh, the yeah. child, just oh, like oh my gosh, yeah. no he was very quiet yeah, so he didn't it was an issue mm -hmm. or anything so that was good and she always had him coordinated with her you know whether yeah, it be, you know, a tie or whatever, the or a Harvard the hat. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> so there are very um, famous quotes through this that I just always remember. And it's just, I object. It's a simple <laughs> one. But <laughs> when uh, the guy whistles at her in the beginning, so you guys were laughing at that. Yeah, that was right. hearing that you guys. Right, yeah. That That's cracks right. me up. And then the bend and snap. I used oh to joke about gosh, that all the time. Right. And how everyone there got really into it. Like everyone's oh, just see, best friends. And see, that's what I mean. She's just so positive. 
inclusive. She oh, gets definitely. everybody she gets like, come yeah. on, everyone's included. And everyone's receptive everybody. of it. I'm like, okay, yeah. And that one woman is like kicking and going crazy. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> it's like a cat. It's like when you get too stimulated, it's like, oh, oh, I got the zoomies. <laughs> so yeah, every yeah. moment of this movie was, was a lot of fun. It was very fun. good. Yes. Yeah. So yeah. I'm glad we were able to watch this oh, together. Yeah, right. I am too. Mm -hmm. Loved it. And mom, you really enjoyed it too. Yes, I sure did. And you enjoyed too. Alan Emmett. Oh and, yes. Um, one thing which I get the movie was wrapping up and it ended well, but we see movies sometimes where they just give you, um, you know, words at the end, that text at the end where they just explain what happened yeah. to resolve it. And I wish we could have seen that instead of reading it. Like I wanted to yes. see her and Vivian like two years later. Yeah, they yeah, graduated. Yes. And I wish we had like a montage of her and Vivian like hanging out yeah. with all her other friends That's and right. laughing and then her with Emmett like hugging or something just being happy um and it, again it was a nice ending but I was kind of thinking and again I saw this before so I'm overthinking more over analyzing yeah. everything but you know I, I'm just seeing them you just see close-ups of their face and I'm like they're all probably not even in the same room doing the scene and it's kind yeah, of sad yeah. to me because I want to see them all together and happy but you know, text-wise, we know everyone's happy. Oh, yeah. Besides the graduation. Yeah. Part. That's good. Yeah. And I and I, I agree with that as well because like with Emmett leaving Callahan's firm and going on to his own, that's a huge thing too. You know. Yeah. But I, he pretty much had to because he said, "No, I'll, you know, I'll be her supervisor." Mm -hmm. You know. It, so. it kind of made me think. I, I like how that happened, but um, or that they did that for him, but like the creators, <laughs> they did that for him, um, but. I felt like they ran out of time making this movie, so they just had to like conclude everything really fast and said, okay. we'll just type that up and then just have them all smiling yeah. and clapping okay. and everything. Yeah. But it but is satisfying. She graduated. Yeah. That she was graduated the and that was thing. the big She thing. is an exactly. attorney, you know, and she didn't, she didn't, she pursued Warner, but at the end she didn't want him. That's right. Yeah. And predictable, she's not, he yeah, she's regretted. Not settle. Yeah, he regretted, um, breaking up with her and he just went right back and he's like oh Pooh Bear exactly what we thought what would happen well, she's <laughs> it's like, so terrible no, I don't think so yeah it looks that like no cutscene scene either I don't remember being what there being one anyways but all right so um anything else you'd like to add no I just enjoyed no, it, it was very fun. much you don't object it was an amazing yeah, movie yes that's right. very positive <laughs> she was very positive yes and I love the music yeah, too yeah. it's like perfect yeah. for this film and her so, friends were too. Very oh, yeah. Positive. They all were great. It was fun, and their <laughs> yeah. outfits are wonderful. So let us know what you thought of this movie. Yeah. Thank you so much for Thanks, watching. Yeah. We'll see what we're going to be watching next. It's up to you guys. We have polls on our YouTube and on our Patreon. Have a great day. Yeah, see you next time. Day. Bye, guys. Bye.